Hi everybody, welcome to my channel Frugal Listener. My name's Sam, where I talk about all things sewing. And today is day 49 of 100 days of sewing and another Frugal Friday. Whee! Uh, so today I've got some free patterns, some discounts and some giveaways for you. Uh, but first of all, I'd just like to say thank you to everyone who's subscribed so far. And if you're new to this channel and you, this is the sort of thing that you like, where there's some frugal tips and hints and tips for sewing techniques, please consider subscribing and hit the notification bell where it will notify you when I've got new videos out. That's usually on a Friday, usually got something midweek, and then on a Sunday I've got plans and reviews and that sort of thing. So on to today's video. So I'm going to start with a lovely pattern that my friend Debbie told me about and that is the Galena dress by Little Lizard King and this is a dress designed for knits and looks lovely and comfortable. It's got a lovely uh, puff sleeve detail and you've got a few options with that. You can go long bishop sleeved or you can keep it short with a piece of elastic in uh, to give it a nice girly feel or it is a puffed sleeve and you can just put a hem band on it, on it. So you've got quite a fitted bodice and quite a, a full skirt on it. And then you've got two options for the length. You can make it as a top with a peplum and then on the bodice, you've got the option to put like a faux placket down there. So I think this is a lovely, lovely design. The sizing goes from a 31 and a half inch bust up to a 45 inch bust, which it equates to a zero to 18 in US sizing. And you've got an AO printing option there as well. So yeah, lovely, lovely dress. And if you're thinking of making something for Valentine's, that might be a nice option. It's not far off. And I do have another video coming out just focusing on gifts for Valentine's days. But today I thought I'd just keep this separate because it would be too long if I did, did it all together. So look out for that one. This is a new to me pattern company. I've never seen this pattern company before, but when I've looked, she's got nearly 400 patterns on there, including a child's version of this dress, which it could be like a mommy and me version, if that's your thing, and that's free as well. So I think that'd be a really, really lovely, comfortable dress. So if you're going to wear it for Valentine's, you can have steak and chips and you won't be feeling too uncomfortable. So I think this would be a relatively simple make. There's no closures on it, there's no zips or buttons. Uh, it's just a knit so it just comes straight over your head and quite a, a nice scoop neckline. And yeah, nice, comfortable and easy, easy to wear as well. So thanks Debbie for letting me know about that one. Definitely a new to me pattern company and go take a look. The, the styling of some of the children's clothing is probably not to everybody's taste. Uh, but there's room for everybody, I think, and I can't believe I've never come across this pattern company before. 400 patterns. <laughs> uh, I've not looked at them all, so I don't know what, what there is, but there's quite a lot of children's patterns on there, and she's got quite, quite a few free ones as well, so worth checking out. So my next free pattern is from Life So Savory. If you remember, I featured this pattern company just before Christmas because she had that lovely sling backpack pattern that I made for his Christmas present. So she keeps churning out all these lovely free patterns, fantastic um, little hoodie that she's got here with a cowl neck. You've got an optional drawstring uh, that you can put grommets in if you like. Nice long sleeves, lovely and cosy make for winter. And then you've got the optional side pockets and splits at the hem as well. So that comes in sizes 0 to 22 and equates to a 32 inch bust up to a 48 inch bust and is obviously made for like sweater knits and things like that. She mentions a fabric called Hatchie. Um, it's not something that I'm familiar with. I have seen it, but I don't really know what it is. And so if you know what it is, let me know below in the comments and let everybody else know. I'm not sure how widely available that is over in the UK and sweatshirt and fleeces and things like that. Once again, I'll just warn you about her pattern instructions are in the form of a, a blog post and there's a lot of adverts on there. But you can pay a fee just to, I think it's just a dollar or two dollars or something to get a free downloadable instructions. If you find it a little bit distracting, I manage fine for the bag, but all the instructions are there on the blog post. So I thought that was a really nice pattern. So I've got a couple of woven dress patterns for you this time and another pattern company that's new to me. This isn't a brand new pattern, it's been out a couple of months, but I've just I've just been made aware of it. That is a rear dress by Belle Etoile. So this looks like a really nice, comfortable suitable make, uh, suitable for woven, so it'd be nice in a linen, short sleeves, grown on sleeves, and you've got two neck options with this one. So you've got a rounded neck and a V-neck. Looks a lovely, easy to wear one. I don't think there's fat side pockets incorporated, 
but you certainly could put those in and then if you don't like it loose at the waist you can make yourself a belt for that as well. The first language isn't English in this one and I've not had a proper look at the instructions but there are English instructions. I think there's Dutch and I think there's German as well so if you speak any of those languages you're, uh, you're laughing. And she's got quite a few patterns on there that have been translated to English. So that's right up my street is that one. I, I would definitely make that one. So next up, I've snuck this one in because it's not in English, but if you've got rudimentary French like I have, I've got rudimentary, rudimentary English, never mind French, I think you could probably work it out. It is quite a simple one. And another one would be would be it would be a lovely dress to make in a, a red or a, a black little black dress as a Valentine's and I just I just absolutely love this uh, tie detail on the shoulder here so yeah it's quite a small size range and uh, but if you've got rudimentary French or Google Translate I'm, I'm pretty sure you could work this one out and if you want I might do a sew along for this one because I think I would make this no zips or buttons like the one that I've just mentioned the rear dress there's a there's the quite simple makes I think it's self-lined in that you cut two bodices and uh, you put the t you pull the ties through, uh, so you've no bias binding around the neck or anything like that. And it comes in sizes 36 inch bust to 42 inch bust. They're calling it small to extra large, and you've got a couple of length options, so you can make it as a top, you can make it as a above the knee dress. Or it would be lovely in a viscose as a holiday dress with side splits. I thought that would be a really nice holiday dress. Bit cold for us here in the UK at the moment, but with a cardigan over, I think you'll be fine. If you're thinking of something for a Valentine's, it doesn't actually suggest a crepe, but I can't see why you wouldn't do it in a crepe de chine. Uh, and it's saying linen and cottons for the fabrics for that one. I thought I'd include a bag one because I've got lots of people that like making bags and this looks like a really nice simple one. So Benina have this bag and it's called the Lou bag and I think that's named after Vanessa Lou who's designed it. It's just a question of signing up for their newsletter and uh, they will send you a link to this bag. Be warned, there aren't a lot of instructions with it, but I think it's that simple that, you you know, even if you've never made a bag before, I think you'd be absolutely fine with this. And you haven't got a lot of hardware with it, so I just like the design of it. It's just brought in with what they call a carabiner to fasten it. That's it, really, with hardware. I would imagine you can put pockets on the inside if you want, but I did like the design of that, so it'd be a nice, nice big shopper so it'd expand out if you wanted to, you didn't have to have that fastening on. Just around about half a metre of fabric for this one, so you'll be looking at vinyls or I think you could do it in a canvas as well, and uh, a lining as well, same amount of lining. I think that's a good one if you're at the beginning of your bag making journey, or, you know, if you just want a, a nice, quick, easy, easy sew and you fancy making someone a bag as a gift, off yourself <laughs> perfect for taking out shopping uh, because you've got you've got the option to expand it by take, releasing that carabiner I think that's only available in the month of January so if you want that one get it downloaded all the rest as far as I know are free indefinitely so that's four free patterns for you uh, on to discounts now so winter wear designs have got a lovely top out they, they bring it out on a Thursday but they, they do seem to keep the offer on for the week uh, so that's three dollars for this button-up shirt. Uh, so if you're wanting to expand your st skills a little bit, uh, it's got a princess seam, so you've got the opportunity to get a really nice fit with it. And I find uh, princess seams can be quite flattering as well. Yeah, you've got the full collar on there, so really if you're wanting to expand your st skills onto shirt making and don't want to spend a lot on a pattern, I think this would be a good one. When to wear designs instructions. I've used their patterns before and they are very, very thorough with their instructions. So you've got a collar and a collar stand, buttons and the princess seam. So lots and lots of uh, new skills there that you can explore if you've not done them before. This, this one is for wovens and your size range goes from extra, extra small to extra, extra large, which is a 28 inch to a 48 inch bust. And then you've got a back yoke as well. And again, back, things like back yokes and princess seams all help with fitting and with that then you've got the colour blocking um, options or just mix and mix in and matching your fabrics or keep it plain and you've got quite a few sleeve options here as well so you've got a long sleeve with a tab a long sleeve with a cuff and a placket so again another another way to expand your um, sewing techniques a three-quarter length sleeve which is just plain or with a tab 
and then the short sleeve or sleeveless so tons and tons of options here and uh, you've got front pockets with or without pocket flaps as well so i think that's a really good one i would definitely pick that one up i think so ellie and max wacky wednesday they do last for the week and uh, they have several pack patterns that you can pick up for a dollar throughout the week this week they've got the tuesday hoodie which you can make for the man in your life that would be a good one if you want to make something for a Valentine's gift or just a birthday gift or something like that. So it's designed for knit fabrics and uh, it looks like you've got lots of options for colour blocking and with being a hoodie obviously you've got a hood and the kangaroo pockets. That goes from sizes extra small to 5XL which equates to a 32 inch chest to a 16 inch chest. I would imagine with a 32 inch chest that would be suitable for teens as well. You could have fun with colour blocking on this one if you've got lots of little scraps that you want to use up or lots of coordinating scraps that you want to use up. And LA and Max instructions are always really good as well. They also have the Monday morning dress. I'm not sure why it's called that. I don't know if it can, can be whipped up on a Monday morning or whether it's just easy to wear on a Monday or, you know, just a day dress, if you like. So it's designed for knit fabrics with a good re recovery. So 50% stretch with four-way stretch as well. So that means that it stretches that way and that way. So something like a scuba or a, something with a little bit of lycra in it that's going to recover. So by that, I mean... Uh, when you stretch it out it recovers to what it was before so it doesn't it doesn't stretch out too much nice and comfortable and easy to wear and generally easy to sew as well i have done a, a video about sewing with knits when i demonstrated making a mandy boat tee which is tea here a uh, long sleeve tee uh, with a lot of hints and tips but one of my midweek uh, videos that's coming up i'm going to sort of condense that and just do my 10 top tips for sewing with knits so if you can refer back to that one it's a little bit easier so this unusually for a knit dress has got side seam pockets i think that's probably why you want a, a knit that's got good recovery because you don't want something that you put pockets in and then it just all stretches out it's got a dipped hem as well at the side so it's got a, a fairly fullish skirt fairly fitted bodice and uh, sleeveless. If you're a woman of a certain age and you run hot or you live in a country where it's, it is hot, I think this is a, a lovely, lovely dress. Easy to sew, easy to wear. And there is full video support on this one as well. Uh, she does quite a few video supports on quite a few of her patterns and the instructions are written quite well. Uh, also on the Dollar Wacky Wednesday, there's quite a few sw swimsuits on there, so if you've got holidays planned, uh, now might be the time to pick them up, uh, and also a girl's dress. But currently, all patterns on Ellie and Mac are $4, so if you're thinking of buying any of their patterns, uh, they're all $4, and there's no code required for that, it's automatic. So that's Ellie and Mac this week. Fibre Mood have got a, an offer on until Sunday the 24th of five patterns for 15 euros. So that makes it three euros each. So you can choose any of their patterns on their website and they've got lots and lots of patterns on there. If you've been seeing any, like the, I think it's the Nora top or, you know, there's been lots and lots on Instagram. If you've been thinking, oh, that's quite a nice pattern, but, you know, might be a bit expensive to buy. They, they bring out a mag magazine and then I think all the patterns are available on the website for it's six or seven euros and they do keep bringing out free patterns they've been bringing out free patterns throughout the pandemic i've still got the mika raglan top available which i mentioned in last week's video which is a nice loose fitting raglan top and that's free with the code social mika and that's also free until the 24th and there is a sew along for that one as well i think that's on tonight uh, in several languages including english that's on Instagram Live at 8. So hot off the press now, Helen's Closet have brought out a new unisex pattern and that is the Jackson Pullover and Tee. She's calling this a gender neutral one, so another unisex one. And it can be made in a lot, anything from a lightweight cotton up to a French terre or a sweatshirt fabric. So it seems like a really versatile pattern does this one. You've got a couple of sleeve lengths and you could make matching ones. <laughs> If you're looking for a Valentine's gift matching t-shirts, if that's your thing. She's running 20% off that one until January the 28th and there's no code required for that one. That is automatically deducted. So a couple of giveaways for you now and Stitches and Bobbins have got two metres of rosebud baby card available up for grabs. Your choice of colour in a grey or a pink. All you need to do on that is follow, like and tag a friend and you get a separate entry if you share on your stories. If you're not familiar or au fait with stories, if you go to the So Over 50 account, there is a, a pinned 
uh, post in their stories of how to, to go about using stories, just in case you're new to Instagram. I know I didn't know what to do when I first started. And again, like I say every week, if you want somebody to tag in, you're more than welcome to tag me in. That's absolutely fine. And it does give me a heads up of new ones. So thank you to everybody who's been doing that. I really am grateful. That one closes tomorrow. That's Saturday the 23rd. If you want to join in that one, it's really nice baby card. Do that before tomorrow. The next one is Ethel and Joan. She's been running a giveaway throughout January and that is for some resin buttons and that is for both you and a friend to win. So she's been doing this weekly throughout January. This one closes on Saturday the 23rd as well. Again, it's tag, like and follow. I'm not sure whether that's UK only or not. It doesn't actually say. But yeah, they, these are really nice resin buttons and I mentioned that one last week. And then Alex, Alex Judge, so has tagged me into one for something a little bit unusual and that is mini looms. So still sewing related, but if you're into mending or visible mending, there are three mini looms available, three sizes. So it's the usual rules, like and tag a friend, and that one's open until the 1st of February. Just a quick one that I've been notified by my friend Chris. So Dainty has one and a half meters of fabric up for grabs, and that is by, Gra by Grazilia. And on top of that, she's got a piece of jewelry from her website, which is uh, this, this sort of thing, acrylic jewellery. I won this from another competition from her. But she's got all sorts of different pieces of jewellery on there now. And that is tag a friend and you can tag as many as you like and that closes at three o'clock on Monday the 25th. That's over on Instagram. So one that's not on Instagram and that is to win a rivet press. Now I've got one of these uh, and the retail at £75. This is UK only, sadly. That's probably because of posted. Uh, that's by The Green Machine. If you've lusted after a rivet press for a while and be really handy for those grommets on the, uh, the sweatshirt that I mentioned earlier, that is through Love Sewing Magazine and it's just a question of going onto their website. You do need to register. They have also all sorts of uh, competitions on. Yeah, you need to register and it's UK only, but there's three of them up for grabs, so it's not just one, so you've got better chances. I think that closes at the end of February but I'll put the date in the details down below. So a lot of the others that I mentioned last week are still available as well. So this uh, Sewn on the Tine has got some vouchers. Uh, that's a YouTube channel. Viv Mom Sews has also got uh, some vouchers up for grabs. She's got a YouTube channel, but she's running the competition on Instagram. And that's $100. It's a top price for that one. And that's to sew something blue, which I sewed this one. This is the uh, Galaxy T by Pattern Scissors Cloth. And I will do a full review of that one. Uh, that's probably coming up on Sunday. The Hertz Gavana, which is open to US citizens only, that is still open as well. But if you want to go to my last week's video and have a look at that one, quite a few of the competitions are still running and obviously a lot of the free patterns are still available on there as well. Right, that's it from me today. Thank you for watching. Put all the details below. And like I say, if you like this sort of thing, I've got coming up, I've got a Valentine's special coming up next week, next Friday, where I'll talk about all the gift ideas I've got for Valentine's and I've got tutorial videos coming up and a review. So if you want like that sort of thing, please remember to subscribe. And if you hit the notification bell, that will tell you when I've got new videos out. Thanks for watching. I shall speak to you later. Bye.